What is going on, Phantom Army? It is your boy, Phantom Stiltson. Welcome back once again to Control. Welcome back to part nine, guys. I hope you guys have enjoyed the series up to this point. Make sure to like and subscribe if you guys are brand new to the channel. That way you guys don't miss any new content of this game and other gameplay series and videos and content on the channel. But without any further ado, we're going to jump back into Control with Jesse here and continue our story. So we're on the mission Polaris. We still have to reach dimensional research. Uh, we got the cassette player from Ati last episode, so we're going to go ahead and go into our fast travel here. And we have some ability points we can spend, so what haven't we upgraded yet? So we could do some energy, that's three. Could do. Let's do some melee, because that, either melee or shield, because uh, those are the ones that are lacking. So let's see, can we do, let's do, let's do shield. So we got to upgrade on our shield. What is this? When released, shield propels debris at nearby enemies. Ooh, that could be useful. Okay, so we're probably going to want to do melee next or possibly more shield. What is this over here? Levitate duration. Go ahead and unlock that because we have one more point. Okay, so we spent all of our ability points. And then we'll go ahead and fast travel here. See if we can go back to dimensional research. Research. Ashtray maze. That's where we want to go because we got to get through that maze with the cassette player. So here we go, guys. All right, guys. So here we are back at the ashtray maze and we're going to probably put on the cassette player and see if we can get through this thing. I'm really digging the music right now, man. I love that they added that. I was expecting it to be some like, I don't know, like Finnish folk song and it's like hard rock. That's hilarious, bro. That's, that's awesome. Get out of my game, bro. Let's go. This is trippy, dude. I love the music, though. The atmosphere of this game is is fantastic. Okay, where am I supposed to go from here? Oh, the floor came up, okay.
All right, so we took all those guys out. We're still kind of low on health here. rid of the hiss cluster. Ow. Trying to sort of dodge this, get some of this health here. There we go. Took him out. Let's pick up all this stuff. All right, so now we gotta go through over here. That was a pretty epic battle, man. Whoa, what's up, big kahuna? Okay, let's see, where do we go? I'm assuming we have to go up there.
Yeah, that was pretty cool, man. Projector. The expedition into Slidescape 36. What Darling brought back changed everything. Okay. We got another message from Trench. There's the area for the slide projector. Dimensional research. Yeah, you want me here. Finding the projector was how this all began. What started in ordinary ends here. You, me, Dylan. We've all come full circle. Slide projector research. There was a doorway here, to where Dylan and I went, where the projector took us, where we met you. The bureau opened the same door here, but there's just an echo now. Huh. Are you close? Just on the other side? Projector room. So, huh. Do we have to go up here? You have to open a door somehow, I'm assuming. Maybe over here. Projector room and through this door. Oh, here we go. The projector's not here. Moved again. What did Darling do with it? I've got to find out. All right, so we got to search the area for the object to power, so they moved it. from an unknown source in part within the range of audible frequency. It acts in unpredictable ways, causing feedback loops that can tear you apart. Trench insists he heard something else. It made his ears bleed. Our equipment found no evidence of anything beyond the primary resonance. Trench's medical tests show nothing amiss. Okay, that was interesting. So they were talking briefly about uh, Jesse and the fact of uh, what happened in Ordinary. From each slide is a, a physical portal into another dimension. Only one slide remains. And Dylan's sister burned the rest in Ordinary before we could... Yeah, this is what I heard before. It just wasn't uh, very audible. This side towards screen. Hedron Resonance Lab. Oh, I see. We got to match the pattern. Okay.
Expedition 3. We located the source of the resonance in Slidescape 36. It is an entity, a living organism of a considerable mass. I I've named it Hedron based on its physical shape. Hedron? We 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 built Was a that for it. you? Did he bring you here? Is that why you brought me here? You're here. You're here. They have you. I know you. I remember her from ordinary. I thought I'd never see you again. Hang on, I'm coming. All right. So we gotta investigate the Hedron Chamber. How do we get in there? How do we get in the Hedron Chamber? myself to Hedron Resonance fully. It, it is... It's changing me. I... I see you. I've been shown so much. Slidescape 36 was where Hedron stopped the spread of another. Another source of resonance. Trench was exposed to this other. It will now spread. I've done everything I can to stop the Hedron resonance amplifiers. I'm being said one more lesson. Something wonderful, I think. Okay, that was a little different. He's, uh, sounds like he's slowly losing his mind a little bit, man. Well, let's go ahead and go into the Hedron Chamber and see if we can figure out what's going on here. Maybe we have to take this elevator that we passed? Yeah, well, that door's probably open now. Yep. HRA to lock the door. I have to rip it off to get in. Are you sure? Okay, I'll be there. Hang on. This was 
was a mistake. Yeah, just a little bit. Now it's freaking pissed. Got one done. Somebody tells me it's not gonna be this easy, bro. This is way too easy right now. Clear this one. Let's clear this one. So we took out this siphon here. Looks like we got some more to take care of. We go up here onto this ridge and take out this one. But looks if you go, it looks like if you go directly for the siphons, they they take out the hiss. So we're gonna go directly for it and see what we can do here. Hopefully we have enough time to take it out. see there see how if you go straight for the siphon it takes out all the hiss that are surrounding it because the siphons are what are what are powering the hiss from the hedron so if you go for the siphons they're going to take them out um let's see there's got to be more health right okay now we're back to full health but we're gonna just go we're gonna go for the siphons outright looks to be the most uh advantageous way to go take out this guy with the sniper rifle because he's just going to be in our way. Everybody else is below us. There's that one. 
See, if you take out the siphons, every one of the hiss that was just surrounding us is gone now. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go for the siphons outright if we can. They're gonna get harder and harder each time, which is what you want in a video game. You want things to you don't want things to be too easy, but that's the trick. If you go for the siphons, you'll be able to take them all out. There we go. Reach Polaris. Okay, so we got Buku health laying around here. So we're at full health, so that was actually pretty simple. Um, where is, where do we have to go? We have to go up to this thing? We have to go up to the Hedron? Is that where we have to go? Yeah, we're gonna float down here because I don't want to go into one of the crevices and die after we just did all that work. Um, research Hedron Chamber. Okay, where it's saying we have to go to Polaris. Where is Polaris? Maybe it's. One second. Float back up here. comes down and there's nothing there it's just the cell and death I was wrong there was never anything there hello Polaris are you there Okay, that was kind of a ambiguous ending. Um, I assume that Jesse became his. That's that, that looked like that's what happened. I'm not really sure. I hope you guys enjoyed the game. Um, I absolutely loved it. Whoa, what's going on with my screen? I'm assuming there might be a, a cutscene after this. Cause this is really weird it's kind of like tripping me out right now um let's just wait and see if there's a cutscene it looks like there might be
Federal Bureau of Control. How may I help you? I need those field I'm reports so typed sorry. up and in management's I'm hands. Here. First thing the tomorrow. Bureau, the best at what it does, protecting everyday Americans from foreign threats. There's the new girl, standing around daydreaming. She should be getting work done. Who the hell does she think she is? The director? Check the notice board for tasks. What the hell? Tidy up the coffee cups, scan the forms. Time is money. Please give me a chance. I can do better. You're dismissed. Glad to be of assistance. The hell is this, dude? This is trippy as hell. What is this, dude? This is weird. Thank you for giving me a chance. Okay, deliver mail. So we missed three desks. No problem. Hey, tidy up coffee cups. This is bizarre, dude. Right, we're gonna go through it. My pleasure. Anything for the bureau. This is kind of repetitious, huh? Well, it says take control, so... It's gonna have us keep doing repetition. the director's mail to his office. Uh, how do we get to the director's office? That's the question. yourself in the director's office. Oh, great. I was just waiting for my mail. 
Just please, take the outgoing mail as well. Thank you. Very good. Better run along now. What? What is happening? I don't like this. No, this isn't me. I'm not me. I can't. Why can't I feel you? Something I can't think. Oh, I'm lost. Where are you? I can't feel anything. I I don't want to be alone here. Where am I? What is this? Why won't it end? Wake up, please. I want to go home. Oh, have you seen him, Mr. Clayton? I mean. Oh, there's Dylan. What are you doing, dude? Creepy ass. You should keep trying. You are getting closer. I need to go inside. I need to keep moving. Okay, we have to get inside somehow. And we knocked on the door and we can't get in that way. So we gotta find some way to get inside the director's office, it looks like. the hell? Forgot something. Oh, have you seen him? Mr. Clayton, I mean... Oh, it's your fault. You didn't want to be here. On the desk. It's on the desk. Dylan's right there. got to pick up something that'll get us inside that director's office. So we've got the mail, but where did we get the mail from? Shelter service hatch. I'm so confused, dude. So we had So we had the mail to get us in the first time. But where did we get the mail from? I can't remember where it was in this area. Open up the shelter maybe. Anything in here? No. Job. 
Nothing in here. It's on the desk, so I, I've got to pick something off of, I've got to pick up something off of the desk. Oh, here it is. Okay. Where's the director's office? Central executive. Director's office is this way, I believe. Which way is it? It's this way. Yeah. got trench first he turned on the projector he let them in i have to remember the hiss the hiss is the enemy trapped in here they're taking over none of this is real yeah it's it's definitely not real i'm not doing this anymore okay uh the director is this way so this is really trippy bro i don't understand really what's happening here i'm sure we're gonna find out at some point it's not really making any sense. I will fight this. I will find a way to push them out. You are a worm through time. The thunder soul storage you. I know what I must do. Start at the beginning. I should have seen it earlier. This is my mess to clean up. My fight. No one else's. I am the director. Hello. This is Dr. Casper Darling. I have a classified message for the director of the Federal Bureau of Control. I have sad news. Pedrin is gone now, but it was not a source. It was a catalyst. Do you understand? You must go to my office, the end game. It will be revealed. Okay, so we have to find Darling's office. That's me. Wow, dude, this game's getting trippy, bro. Find Darling's office. Okay, so we have to be in Executive Affairs. Where is Darling's office? Dead 
I can't feel you. I can't. This is what Dylan wanted all along. But there is something. I can feel it, but I don't know what. The motel is a place of power, of change, a place to pass through, connecting everything. This is a dream inside my head. Why shouldn't it take me anywhere I want to go? Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Dude, are you kidding me right now? Yeah, I can't. Were we supposed to watch that whole video? So weird. Yeah, just a little bit. But it is my head. You are such a weirdo, Jesse. <laughs> yeah, that's the that's the one we came in on. That's the light switch we came in on. Can't go out that way. Can't use that door. Can't use the, the buzzer again the ring the the bell grow brighter around one constant they revolve Hedron is dead, but you're alive here in me. Maybe Hedron put you in our heads when we met her. Maybe you were always there, and she was just trying to teach me how to trigger you. Maybe I'll never understand. Maybe I don't need to. Trench was the first to be corrupted by the Hiss. Slowly, over the years. His need for control only made it worse. It was Trench who took the projector to the nostalgia department. He opened the door to the Hiss. Just like that. With Hedron dead, the Hiss tried to corrupt me too. But I'm stronger than them. We're stronger. They're waiting. They'll try to stop us. Okay, so we gotta turn off the slide projector. We have to take control. dream a bad dream and the whole world was dreaming with her Dylan she convinced herself that she was awake she's always been stubborn I knew I had to end her dream I had to wake her up I had to rip down poster she'd been staring at. Cut off her eyelids to make Jesus. To save her. Okay, where do we go? Let's see.
Okay, so we lost some health there. I'm not sure why. Um, so if we stay on these platforms, I'm assuming we're okay. We just got to stay from way, away from where the hiss is at. Okay, so we have to traverse this place. Not really sure how we do that. We have to go up or down, that's the question. Do we go down there? I am so confused about where we go right now. Okay, looks like I might be on the right path here. Here we go. I know he's still there somewhere. Locked inside. I know, because that's how it was for me. Okay, so we have to reach Dylan, so I'm assuming he's over there. we go. Took Big Cahoon out. Get out of here. Alright. So now... Oh, we still got guys to deal with.
Alright, looks like we're gonna be able to traverse closer. Continue on this way. Oh, we got some people behind us. Get out of here. Continue to go this way. Looks like we got some more stuff coming up. Yep. Okay. Gonna have some more enemies to deal with. switch to our uh, actual gun like it shoots like multiple shots where's the little phantom thing little thing that floats around here it is This way, yep. Where's the little thing that screams at us? I'm gonna take that thing out before we take out Big Kahuna over here. There we go. Okay, where is dude at? There he is. He's got like, he's like literally one shot. There we go. Freaking exploding things are everywhere, dude. Take him out. Got these guys.
Ow. Buku health over here. There's a lot of health to come by, so we should be okay. Um, go over this way. Take care of these little miscellaneous guys. They're just running around. Another one? Good lord, dude. Where do we have to go? Still got these screeching things, man. That's where we came from. Almost there. We're coming, Dylan. We're coming, bro. in a coma I don't know if there's anything of him left in there if he'll ever find his way back the portal's been closed but the hiss is still in the oldest house and the lockdown can't be lifted as long as any trace of it remains I'm working on a solution with my management team but there is still a long road ahead I'm the director of the Federal Bureau of Control. We're in this together. You... ...and I. Alright guys, so I think that's the end of the game? We could be surprised here very shortly. Um, let's just watch and make sure there's no cutscene or something. Um, just because we got surprised before and it might not be over yet. I'm not sure. Let me see here. But we'll speed up the credits here. And we'll see if there's anything at the end that we have to do or anything we have to watch. Maybe there's a cliffhanger. 
obviously that was a pretty big cliffhanger so let's go ahead and speed this up um I guess we could possibly skip the credits, but I don't also I also don't want to skip the credits and miss something that you guys would probably want to see. There's something at the very end of the game, I'm not sure. Go ahead and skip the credits. You're the director of the Federal Bureau of Control. The crisis is not over. Your work is not done. Okay. Do we have another mission to do? As he finds an agent in the Panopticon who has been left to stare at a refrigerator altered item. He can't stare much longer, but if okay. All right, so apparently all that's left is or execu execute board countermeasures and bureau alerts to fight the ongoing hiss threat, search the dangerous depths of the oldest house for classified bureau secrets and hidden clues. So I'm assuming all that's left is the side missions or to do like 100% completion. Um... I don't think there's anything left. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, Control. It was a very, very ambiguous game. Um, very fun game. Very challenging game. I can see why um, they actually just won the Golden Joysticks uh, award for this game. And it was actually announced today or yesterday. And I can see why. The game was very challenging, very ambiguous, but very, very interesting nonetheless. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to like and subscribe if you guys are brand new to the channel. I absolutely loved this game. Uh, I said at the beginning of the series that Remedy is one of my favorite, if not my favorite, game studio. Um, I love what Sam Lake does. And again, uh, I was a little um, taken back and uh, very, very impressed with this game. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, make sure to like and subscribe if you guys are brand new to the channel. That way you guys don't miss any new content or videos or walkthroughs or anything I put on the channel. But without any further ado, this is your boy Phantom Stilts. I will see you guys on the next gameplay series. Take care, guys.